Hi, I'm Josh. I'm Ollie. And this is the world of Dave. <laughs> Very good. Yeah, I mean, the it thing is. is, the name of our show is Our Names Combined. Yeah. And then when we have a guest, we normally work the guest's name into the thing. But you, even though you have loads of friends on your show, it's the world of Dave. It's, it's Dave's world. world. Yeah, Dave's world. You're yeah, like this like true. Thanos-style <laughs> leader. It's like Tony Stark wanted to rename the Avengers. <laughs> Tony, the world of Tony Stark. The world of Tony Stark. <laughs> <laughs> 옛날에, 옛날에 영어 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 what comes to mind? We got chips and fries and crisps. Oh, and crisps. crisps. So crisps are American chips. 한국 사람들도 chip, 감자 칩이라고 하거든. Like 감자 칩, potato chips. Ah, uh, if you say to an English person potato chips, it's an Americanism, but you get what you're, what they're okay, saying. So you but if you say to an English person chips, they'll think you're saying fries. Fries. So we got crisps or chips and fries. They're chips. Yes. Crisps are the things which are crispy. That, that makes sense. Yes. I mean, I'm not going to say it doesn't make sense. 다소 헷갈릴 수 있으니 집중하고 봐주세요. 감자칩을 미국에서는 칩이라고 하는데 영국에서는 크리스프라고 해요. 그런데 영국에서도 칩이라는 단어를 쓰긴 하는데 감자칩이 아닌 다른 의미로 쓰여요. 바로 무슨 뜻이냐면 감자튀김이라는 뜻이에요. 좀 복잡하죠? We say Band-Aid. Ah, uh, plaster. Plaster. Isn't Band-Aid also the name of a company? It, it might be. It, it is. is. Yeah. Whereas a plaster is, I guess, from like Victorian times. He's got a wound! Put some you plaster on it! Like, like some guy with a moustache <laughs> mixing up a bucket of plaster with a... You know, just painting from. it on. Back! <laughs> You'll be fine! Band-Aid. Plaster. Yaku. Pharmacy. I can't, I don't know. Okay. <laughs> yeah, we, um, we use them all interchangeably. We can say chemist, we can say, also say pharmacy. You guys really say chemist? Chemist. Yeah. yeah. That's so strange. We would never say chemist. Oh, really? With anything related to medicine. Interesting. Huh. So, like, a chemist is like. <laughs> okay. Okay. Like, that's yeah. what it to us. Or like someone who does chemistry. Breaking yeah, you could, that's like a different type of chemist. But that we will sense. never say chemist for anything okay. yeah. medicine related. 미국에서는 파마시라고 하는데, 영국에서는 chemist. 한대요. 근데 미국인들한테 케미스트는 화학자라는 뜻이에요. 화학하는 사람이요. The hood of a car. Hood. Bonnet. The bonnet. Yeah. Bonnet is very British, and a hood is very American. Yeah, yeah. We say a hood for the front of the car. What do you say for the back of the car? Boot. They say boot. We say trunk. No, you say boot. We say trunk. In fact, both the English terms and the American terms are clothing. Yeah, that's true. That is true. So in the English one, they're imagining the car is a baby, maybe wearing boots because it's wearing a bonnet, and it's going down the road like this with. <laughs> it's it's feet at the back, whereas in America, it they're wearing a hood, and then in the back it's a trunk. So they're just where are the legs? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know where that... It does not make sense. It does not not make sense. Okay. Undongwa sneakers. Trainers. Trainers. Trainers is somebody who trains somebody in a sport, like a Pokemon trainer. If you say <laughs> he's a trainer, he trains at somebody at the gym, he's a basketball trainer. Right. Yeah. Trainer has nothing to do with shoes in America. It's interesting though, because like everywhere there's a lot of American media. Yeah. Everyone knows what you mean when you say sneakers. Sneaker Every culture is like its own thing, whereas trainers are like, they're just like Undongha. Like, yeah, Undongha. Like, like, yeah. like, yeah. What do you guys call trainers who actually train people? Coach or a personal trainer? So a personal pair of shoes. Uh, well... <laughs> <laughs> double meaning. Yeah, double, double meaning. meaning. See, that doesn't exist in America. We don't have double yeah, meaning. Yeah, yeah right! <laughs> <laughs> a slice of pickle. A pickle, yeah. we call them. A gherkin. What is that? I literally did not... Somebody said gherkin, I'm like... Yeah. 
A yeah, gherkin, gherkin is, is a, a pickle. Spot, is a pickle. Does anything you never get a whole pickle? You would never at like a restaurant be served like a whole pickle. I guess the way that they started getting eaten in England first was probably in like McDonald's burgers. burgers in slices. So you didn't really have a pickle culture. And everyone was like, take the flipping gherkins out. Who wants gherkins in your burger? Not very popular anymore. You don't use the word pickle? Nah, pickle we use in like to refer to something that is preserved in vinegar. Cheese and pickle sandwich, in that case, pickle is like Branston pickle. Brown with little cubes in it. Sorry. I didn't quite get that. <laughs> okay. yeah. It's like kind of chutney. What's Ch chutney? Sour what's, chutney. What's chutney? Oh man. I'm going deep now. What's Jeez. chutney? And it's like pickle. Well, what's a chutney? That's pickle. That is pickle. That's not a pickle. That's poop. <laughs> <laughs> that's just poop. <laughs> Poop. It's that, really good. Yeah, I think yeah. I honestly think really like it. it the is. main well, brand yeah. is called Branston. Branston pickle, and you have it with pickle. cheese in a sandwich. It's just a bunch of pickle and some cheese, and it's quite basic. Really, cool. we're, we're not that creative. I'm curious what Branston pickles are. We'll so. bring some next yeah. time. Are we gonna try it? Yeah, I'm down to try it. That's. Okay. I've never had anything British in my entire life. Never yes. had British snacks. Like oh, nothing. I, British. I don't even know what a dessert would be or a British lunch item would be. Eat and mess. What's that? <laughs> Spotted dick. <laughs> Spotted dick is a dessert. Is it a dessert? Or I mean, to a certain person. I don't know what. Who considers that a dessert? Wait, is it really called spotted dick, Josh? Yeah, it's, a, yeah, it's, yeah, it's a very traditional dessert called spotted dick. You've got toad in the hole. You've got toad in the hole. Bubble and squeak. You've got bangers and mash. Shepherd's pie. You guys sound like you're making up a bunch of things. <laughs> I'm sure in a what? In a what? In a what? <laughs> Mole in a sink. A <laughs> dog. <laughs> Stargazy pie. Oh, what? Oh, jelly eels. <laughs> Wait, are they actually eels? Yeah, they're eels in jelly, served cold. Yuck! Oh my it's gosh. David Beckham's favorite food. That's stargazy pie. No. <laughs> it's got fish heads in it. No, are you serious? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. We say trash can. Rubbish bin. Rubbish bin. Put it in the bin. Yeah, put, put it in, in the bin. bin. Come on. Pick up that rubbish. Put, put it in, in the bin. bin. Yeah. Yeah, we normally just call it the bin. To be honest, not a trash can. But it is rubbish and bin, and we never yeah. use trash. But the word we trash know, is know, used, right? Yeah, we know what it means, but People we would never use yeah. it. You can say someone's trashy, you can say someone's trash, but can you say someone's rubbish? Ah, yeah. We're like, oh, this is, this is, like, this is rubbish. Oh, I'm having a rubbish time. Or a rubbish oh, day. Mate, you are rubbish at football. Exactly. You are a stupid piece of Rubbish. <laughs> no one says that. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't know that. Really. No, no, no. <laughs> you looked straight at me and said it. <laughs> With like intense eyes. <laughs> it hurt. You are, not, you are not a piece of rubbish. Thank you. Yeah. Young Hong um, So we say movie theater. Ooh, movie okay. theater. We say cinema. 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 Yeah, See, cinema. we use the word cinema, cinema, but it's usually referred to movies, as in like yes. I enjoy cinema, which means I enjoy movies, but we don't call the actual place ah, a cinema. Yeah. Okay, yeah, no, it's yeah. always do you wanna to go to cinema time? Our grandparents would call it the pictures. Same in America. Yeah, oh yeah. Yeah, in the thirties, like twenty thirties, like, hey, let's go to the pictures, eh? Yeah. 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 <laughs> My right. dad says that, but then yeah, he's basically good. from that era. Yeah, yeah. yeah. The mall. The mall. Shopping center. Shopping center, that's so strange. We don't have as many of them as you guys do in the yeah. States. Yeah, you guys aren't as developed. They're growing. They're growing. <laughs> <laughs> what you would describe as a mall, we would say is is a shopping centre. Oh, but it's much more common in England to shop on the high street. What's yeah. a high street? It's a big road with a bunch of shops back to back. Oh, okay, okay. It's on like high Main street. street in yeah. American okay. towns. And nowadays, on one high street, there'll be a bunch of big shops, and then like a small shopping centre, and then you know some more shops, and then another shopping centre, all kind of in one spot. Yeah. So there's not just a large, gigantic building. Not I many. mean, there's a few. Not, there's, there's a, a few. few. There's like West three. Three, yeah. three in London. The three or four like big shopping centres in London. People do go there in the same way you go to a mall, and they got a cinema in there. Yeah, 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 yeah. In there. They feel quite merited. They're yeah, that massive. Drunky jump rope. 
Okay. It's that skipping rope. Skipping rope, yeah. But we will never say skipping rope. When you're using a jump rope, what you're are you doing? jumping. You're just jumping. Oh, also, really? Is that it? But you're just jumping jump, with a rope. Jump. Yeah. Skipping is jumping and walking at the same time. That is also skipping. Yes. The act of using a jump rope. There's it, no. No. There's no it. specific jumping rope. Oh, oh you're jumping it? rope. Sounds I'm like rope. Kind of euphemism. I'm jumping rope. Yeah. I'm taking yeah. drugs. <laughs> <laughs> Just jump a rope, bro. Just go behind the house and jump some rope. I was talking to the chemist. <laughs> <laughs> we got it, skipping. Yeah. Skipping the rope. So we say fish sticks. Do you actually say that? Yeah, fish sticks. It's not just like a South Park thing. No, it's yeah. not just a South Park. Do you like fish, fish sticks? I do like fish sticks. Do you like fish sticks? <laughs> <laughs> I like fish sticks. <laughs> so Josh, get me a look. 2009년도에 미국 성인 애니 사우스 파크에 나온 유명한 드립이 있는데, Do you like fish sticks라는 대사예요. Do you like fish sticks? Fish sticks를 빨리 말하면 발음이 살짝 fish sticks 같이 들리거든요. 참고로 fish sticks는 물고기 거시기라는 뜻이에요. 서양에서 유명한 드립입니다. Fish, 물고기, sticks, 막대기. So that's different from like a Korean like omu. Yeah, it's a fry. What do you call it in the UK? Fish fingers. Because <laughs> <Fish fingers. laughs> they look like fingers. Yeah, they do look like fingers. Yeah, I'll give you that. Finger shape. So fish fingers. Fish sticks. When would you eat fish sticks in America? I'm curious. <laughs> um, they're like TV dinner kind of thing. Famously, in England, you can find a fish finger sandwich. That sounds good. It's it's a spot. Canada 나오는 pasta 같은데 we call this spaghettios. Oh. Do we call it spaghetti that? hoops? Okay. You guys say spaghetti hoops. Yeah. You don't say spaghetti o's. No. no, never. Spaghetti o's, and you guys yeah. say hoops. Spaghetti, spaghetti hoops. hoops. That's a nostalgia trip, that. Yeah. I don't think I've had spaghetti hoops since I was about 10. Yeah, that's something kids eat. Yeah. 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 Spaghetti o's are the most popular in the world. Did you have the letters? Oh, yeah, we had letters. Yeah. Yeah. You get letters, you get numbers. Yeah, letters. Like a couple of years ago, I Some was having like pizza. <laughs> Appetizer. Oh, starter. What? You don't say starter. You're, yeah. out of, you're out of control. Are you serious? Starter, you say starter? I, mean, I would say starter makes more sense. sense because appetizer, it doesn't like give you an appetite. It actually takes away from some of your appetite. That's true. <laughs> if you go to a really posh restaurant, you might have an amuse bouche. <laughs> What's an amuse bouche? What do you mean? What? It's like a free starter. I seriously lost you guys. <laughs> we should do like day yeah. tries fine dining. Yeah, in, in London. Oh, we take man. American Savage to a refined thing. They would drink like a drinks to eat. Cookie. Biscuit. That's ridiculous. What? A biscuit is breaded on um, yeah. things you put butter on. That's yeah. a biscuit. No, no, that's, that's, a, like, that's a muffin. That's well, not a muffin. Yeah, muffin is this. An English muffin. Yeah, somewhere between an English muffin and a scone. <laughs> a biscuit is <laughs> it's softer than a scone. It's like savory. That's a crumpet. Yeah, but with gravy and <laughs> chicken, it's not a crumpet. <laughs> this is a biscuit. That's a scone. No, it's not. Yeah, it's Scones a scone. are hard. It's, but it's, it's a different. bit softer. It's really soft. So, so we don't have bait. American biscuits. No, we don't have them. But they're so good. They are actually pretty good. They have them like gravy and chicken. Gravy or butter, yeah. Biscuits. And gravy. How weird is that? that First time I've heard that. But it's really good though. Mine. 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 We think of cookies as like. They're the big like chocolate chip cookies. Yeah. Would you call Oreos? A cookie, yeah. What do we call them? What about uh, digestive? Digestive biscuit. What's a digestive? Sorry, chocolate caramel digestive. Oh, oh. That's like a breakup oh, food. Oh, Sit in the bar with some candles and eat a whole pack while crying. Uh, when you guys say digestive, you make me think of Pepto Bismol <laughs> or Tom. Digestive. What's a digestive? Digestive. These are crackers. No. What? No. Crackers are what you have fun with cheese. Oh, these are biscuits. 정리하자면 미국 쿠키는 이거예요. 미국 사람 사람들이 말하는 쿠키를 영국에서는 비스킷이라고 하는데 미국에서는 비스킷이라고 하면 이걸 말합니다. 이게 뭔지 알죠? KFC에 파는 비스킷. Anyways, cookie biscuit. <웃음> 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 Cookie 
Elevator. Oh, lift. Lift. It makes sense. You're lifting it up. But also elevator. It also makes sense. In a way, I would say elevator maybe makes more sense. That's so crazy. The elevator. I never thought about that. It elevates. It elevates, it elevates yeah. you. The Terminator yeah. uses the elevator. Yeah. But not on, like, a I mean, but lift is kind of strange. It's like calling a plane fly. Yeah, exactly. So I think elevator makes mm. more sense. In the Thank you. Lift is easier 10 to one. say. That's it's easier like. to say. Nobody uses that excuse. This car is easier to say than automobile. <laughs> Else is automobile. Yeah. Terrible example. I'm gonna get in my automobile <laughs> because it's so <laughs> easy to say. <laughs> <laughs> Kindergarten. We don't have a word for that. We have nursery and then reception. Reception is the first year of school. So that's school. kindergarten. Yes. It's the first oh. year is kindergarten. Oh, then. so that's reception. Preschool. Nursery. I think so. Oh, oh yeah. Yeah. Right, right before yeah. school. Okay. Yeah. Like right. four or five years old. Yeah. yeah. Kindergarten. Reception. reception. Elementary school. Chunakyo. Primary school. Primary school. Chunakyo, we say middle school. I don't have a word for that. We don't have those. Hey, what do you mean? We don't do middle school. <laughs> <laughs> well, middle school uh, is 6th uh, to 8th grade. So okay. our primary school goes for a bit longer, okay. and our secondary school starts a bit earlier. Okay. Yeah. Which leads to our next cut word. Out middle school. <laughs> we did. Yeah. There's no middle school. We say high school. Secondary school. Secondary school. Secondary school. And then at 16, for There's the a, final two years, you go to a you different school. A different school. Which called is called college. College. College is for us like Teakyo. Yeah, no. College for us is a separate place where you just do the last two years. Which is also high school. High school. Which is also called sixth form. Sixth form? Yeah. yeah. Sixth form. Year one, two, three, four, five, six. First form, second form, third form. That's first form, second form, third form, form. fourth form removed, fifth form. Days uh, on Instagram. Instagram. <laughs> I had no idea what you guys were talking about either. Yeah. All right. Next one. <laughs> Next word. 영국에서는 고등학교 마지막 2년을 컬리지라고 하는데 미국에는 따로 없는 과정이에요. 미국에서는 컬리지라고 하면 대학교를 의미합니다. Subway. Tube or underground. Shiatar is tube or underground? Yes, yeah, so underground is what it's like officially called. And the tube is like the, the nickname. That's it's quite like London centric though, the London underground. That's literally what it's called, the London underground. The tube is like the colloquial name. What do you guys call the sandwich shop? Subway. <laughs> 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 that would have been smart of Subway. That would have been clever. I wonder if they call it Subway or Tube in Singapore. Mm. For I example, know. Australia. Or I've never been anywhere that calls it anything other than a Subway. Metro, maybe. What's a metro? The train, right? Yeah. Well, it could be a. It could be underground. Okay, Subway is underground or Tube. Or metro apparently. <laughs> <laughs> London 지하철은 London Underground라고 이름이 따로 있어요. 그래서인지 런던 사람들은 지하철을 그냥 Underground라고 해요. 그런데 지하철의 공식적인 명칭은 Tube라고 합니다. So we got this game, we call it Tic Tac Toe. That's weird. And we call it Noughts and Crosses. What? Noughts and Crosses. And Crosses. Noughts and Crosses. Where's the ticks? Or the, the toes? There's no toes in it. Tic Tac Toe. Listen, I didn't make the word. That's <laughs> gross. Let's clarify. He didn't make the language. Tic Tac Toe. I don't know why it's called Tic Tac Toe, but it's okay. called Tic Tac Toe. I know why we call Noughts and Crosses Noughts and Crosses. Because it's Noughts Crosses. <laughs> 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 Zucchini! Courgette. Courgette. What's an aubergine? Aubergine is an eggplant. Yeah. Oh, okay. Wow! <laughs> <laughs> eggplant! Aubergine. But what's a zucchini? A courgette. I must we, say that both of yeah. those English names sound like woodwind instrument instruments. <laughs> Joshua is a wonderful courgette <laughs> Did you hear his aubergine solo? <laughs> Exquisite. <laughs> we use the French word for both of those. We're almost done. Let's, we got three more left, so let's just okay. get this out of the way. <laughs> <laughs> the game is so done. Yeah. I'm just thinking about how I'm going to edit this. Chuchajang. Parking lot. Car park. Car park. Yeah. It's like somewhere where the cars can go with their little cars and play. <laughs> <laughs> the park. <laughs>
like collections of cars, having yeah. big, big, like, big yeah. tents, and all the cars are like sitting in the tents, hiding from the sun. Well, you guys understand parking lot, right? Like everything, we've heard it in films like a thousand times. Yeah, the, what the cool kids say yeah, exactly. over in America. Exactly. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> <laughs> a period. At the end of a sentence, a period. Okay. Full stop. Full stop. Full stop! <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's very descriptive. It's like yeah. a robot had to name yeah. the words in the English language. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm going to take the sentence. Okay, yeah. full stop. <laughs> <laughs> Done, but I've thought of one. X, Y, Z. Mm, Z. Z. Dragon Ball Z. No way. We do say zebra. Zebra, that's right. Yeah, I know zebra. That. zebra. Yeah. I never put those two together. Also, uh, how how do you say Iraq? Iraq. You say Iraq. That might be different. Uh, in oh, is space. it? Some people say Iraq. Some people say Iraq. Oh. Some people say Iran. Some people say Iran. Oh. And some people oh. say Iraq. I walk. <laughs> Some people say idiot, and other people say idiot. Some people say idiot. Some people say idiot. So today we've compared some words we use in British English and some words you use in American English. Does that sound about right? You sound like an idiot. God, you sound like an idiot. Hey, 여러분한테 유익한 영상이었으면 좋겠고 오늘 데이브 조시. I'm Ollie. 이었습니다. 감사합니다.